Good morning everyone. So today is going to be a pretty jam-packed day and I decided why not bring you along with me um, for the parts of it that I'm comfortable carrying camera at least. But first things first, um, I actually have to go back to why? I have to go back to my old town to get my second vaccination. Um, so I'm super excited about that because now I could feel at peace going outside a little bit more um, and you know meeting people and things like that um, so we're doing that and then eventually when I get back here in town I don't know why it's raining right now I hope it's not raining later but I have quite a few errands to run so yeah that's pretty much what we're gonna do right now though we're going to get into the car um, take out our trash on the way out, and just drive to our appointment. Honestly, I don't know who the fuck to trust this is my friend or my fault. Younger, I was happy. Now they feel like no one understand me. I'm gonna order silly on Bob Bambi. Baby, see all the text. She wanna eat me. Okay, so, um, after eight and a half hours, I decided to update you on what I have done today thus far. So, if you don't know, um, I will tell you. Uh, I moved to a city called Wonju, which is about an hour and a half away from the place that I that I used to live at, which is Jungsun. Um, I had to come back to Jungsun today to get my second vaccination because um, when you reserve a spot for your first vaccine, the information including the hospital and time of day actually just like are automatically assigned to you based on like whether or not you need to wait two weeks because i think that's the range it's like every it's you get the first one wait two weeks and they get the second one um however so originally that was going to happen before my contract ended my second vaccine was I was going to get my second vaccine before my contract ended but they found that the longer you wait to get the second vaccine the more antibodies that you create so my appointment was actually pushed back till now and I didn't really bother with um, <laughs> changing or like calling to try to find a place near me because where I live there are quite a lot of people so I kind of just assumed like it would be hard to find space um, for the same day and time so I just didn't bother um, and it ended up being a good thing because I accidentally sent some packages to my old address uh, so I had to pick those up today uh, I also went to the car shop and because I got my severance payment yesterday I was able to fix my tire so something has been wrong I know that something was wrong with my car for the past like month because it was making way too much noise but I didn't decide to actually look and see what it was exactly um, although I was pretty sure I had to change my tires like that's where it sounded like the trouble was coming from I wasn't sure and I wasn't going to check until I had money to fix the problem. Um, thankfully, when my severance pay came in yesterday, I was just like, you know what, I might as well. I'm going to be in town anyway, so I know like the mechanic there. I might as well do that. Um, instead of trying to find like a whole new mechanic and stuff like that. And then my friend is actually going to introduce me to somebody in Wonju. So I will have someone to go to when I need my car fixed. But... Yeah, so, so far we have gotten a vaccine, um, eaten lunch, <laughs> and fixed my tire. Also, I went to the bank and opened up two new accounts. One of them is a savings account, and the other one is a normal account 
but it's a second secondary normal account like I can go to the bank and take out money from this account the same way that I would with the one that I've already had um, but I'm actually planning on using it to kind of separate my finances a bit because it when all of my money is like together it gets kind of confusing for me um, about like what, how much money am I putting towards certain things and, and I will often miscalculate and then end up having a lot less money than I thought I was gonna have so I just feel like having two separate accounts is going to be helpful to manage my finances um, yeah today was supposed to be just a huge like get stuff done type of day so we are off to a great start um, now I'm on my way back to Wonju and I forgot to bring it down with me but I have so I have to go back home but I have some items that I need to return to Daiso and while I'm there I'm gonna pick some stuff up I'm also gonna go to the mall okay so um I just got to the mall I decided to just come here and then go home because the mall is actually like 15 minutes away from home so it makes more sense for me to just like come here and then go there um because Daiso is relatively closer like much closer but I'm gonna try my best to make it look like I'm talking on the phone with someone so that I can get footage of me shopping <laughs> And we'll see how it goes. <laughs> Run up the racks like an athlete. Big fat. Screw the dick. Six flags. Ballin' like. Dick. Told her I love her. I ain't really mean that. Yeah. Now they just people like fun. Remember way back she was love. These bitches sneak again cough. I got four of the one top. I remember I remember. I remember I remember. I remember I remember. I remember I remember. Remember I sound dog food no kibbles. Just to give me some skrilla. Remember I was really on the black like Tetris. Just to give me some chip. Surfing rock in the parking lot. My weed lighter than like the gay bar block. I be on her mind like nonstop. Yeah, had a cut the little thot. No time out. Remember smoking blunts with my friends. The seconds a couple of day. Uh, yeah, lost a lot to the fan. That's the shit got me upset. But at eight, then I found the leaf doggy. I'm smoking with sap. Four, four, I'm a zombie. It's a girl, but she won. These four boys think I'm cock. Pop it straight like Mary Pop. Um, also, in the mall, there's an Auntie Anne's. I'm so happy. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Went to the gym and then went to... Came back here to drop off some stuff. And then went to Daiso to return items and buy a few more. I and mean, that's kind of my day. I think my first day at the gym is either going to be tomorrow or Friday. My classes, I did mess up though with 24 hour fitness and I got a six month uh, membership not realizing that it's September and I only know for a fact that I'll be here until like end of January I think so yeah with any luck I can extend that to end of February but it's still up in the air um hopefully I can in which case there'll be like a final month where I may not use my membership it is what it is <sighs> so yeah um that was kind of my day Good morning everyone. So it's the day after I got my 
<sighs> it's, the, it's the day after I got my second vaccine and I don't think I'm gonna be able to go outside today um just for like my own peace of mind I feel like um which I don't know it sucks because I did start my gym membership yesterday I was just like yeah I'm just gonna come back um like in the morning today in the morning um so I started it but I don't know if I really am up for it right now first of all yesterday I don't know if it was just all the running around um but I started having a headache by the end of the ended up with a headache at the end of the day and right now kind of feels like my head feels like it does when I get sick and I think I have a fever but like I'm not completely sure so I think I'm just gonna stay inside um, as much as possible today move some stuff around in my schedule because there was um, quite a few things that I was supposed to do outside including like go to Starbucks because I need Wi-Fi in order to upload a video today but I think I mean it's a new month so I now have service on my phone so the hotspot should work well enough that I can just turn it on for a little bit and use that to um, upload my video so I'm not too worried but yeah my arm hurts a little bit but it doesn't hurt any more than it did yesterday um by the time I went to sleep it usually like it did the same thing this time that it did last time which is I got the shot and then like eight seven hours later um my arm started to hurt a little bit and then as the day progressed it started to hurt a little bit more and more um and then by the time I went to sleep I woke up again it still hurt just about the same so it's not that bad to be honest it's just like a little bit of pain it is annoying though because I realized with getting these shots that I got it on my left side because I'm right-handed and I didn't want it to like affect my my day but I actually sleep on my left side <laughs> especially like <laughs> <laughs> especially last night oh my god I'm not this popular and it's like 7 in the morning um like especially yesterday I was trying to sleep and I couldn't help but sleep on my left side so it just hurt a lot and I feel like that's probably why it hurts so much now too is because I was sleeping on it um for a great for probably the majority of the night the most flattering angle to exist <laughs> um so it's now like 9 30 um i kind of just relaxed and nodded off for a bit while watching um stephanie sue's latest bam and fever wise i feel like i still have a fever but my headache is pretty much gone now so that's good that's a good sign um thing because I have a fever I'm still not gonna go outside at all today but um I think at this point I can actually get out of bed <laughs> and um try to get some stuff done um I don't know how productive I will be because I'm pretty like groggy as you can probably tell but I'll try my best at the very least to like fold and set aside and clothes and um, build furniture and stuff like that like I think that's what today's gonna be um, a lot of and just like listening to music and relaxing kind of um, just get what I can done i'm probably not going to work on a video today um 
but we'll see. It's definitely not going to go up today, even though that's what I wanted. Um, it's probably going to go up tomorrow instead, and maybe that's the move from now on, is to just put videos up on Fridays. Um, I don't know yet, but we'll see. Ugh. Everywhere I go, the people really want to know who I is and who I be. They stop and stare when they see me.